What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we have another hot sauce review. Imagine that on this channel. Um, <clears throat> today we have a sauce made by um, Ross's Sauces. Um, you can find them at saucebyross.com or Facebook and Instagram at Brugal Hot Sauce. And it is handmade in Latrobe, Pennsylvania, which is maybe about 40 minutes from where I'm at. Going more towards the middle of the state from where Arnold Palmer, the golfer, is from. Uh, and the Pittsburgh Steelers also hold their uh, training camp in July there, too, at a college called St. Vincent College. Anyway, <clears throat> so this is Ross's Sauces. Aji pineapple and blood orange sauce. It says the artwork is by at Lochnitz. Right there, that's who created the label. Cool little label. Love the pineapple on the front. That's really cool. His eyes are blood oranges. That's pretty cool. Looks like they're bleeding. That's awesome. <clears throat> but yeah, um, shake well for dry after opening. And um, it says here, a little right up on the side. Aji pineapple peppers have a nice spice with some awesome citrus undertones. Paired with blood oranges and pineapples, this tropical sauce is sure to brighten up any dish. Now the ingredients. They are Aji pineapple peppers, apple cider vinegar, blood oranges, bell peppers, pineapple, onions, garlic, salt, pepper, and other spices. Do the consistency check. Yeah, it's a little on the thinner side. Let me give it a fair shake here first. It's still a little bit on the, it's on the thinner side, but that don't mean anything. Let's see what it tastes like. I'm already thinking about maybe marinating chicken in this for fajitas or something, but let's see what it tastes like first. <clears throat> or as a salad dressing. So we're going to again give it another good shake. If I get the lid off, there we go. No flow restrictor, love that. Now we'll give it a smell. Oh yeah, you get that. Get a fresh pepper smell. Fresh pepper smell. Smell the bell pepper and the pineapple a little bit. Get the garlic, the onion. Not really getting the vinegar too much. So, with that said, we're going to get out our spoon and give it a try. Steve Gillespie, heat my shorts, check him out, show the label while you pour. Okay. My bottle. And here we go from Ross's Sauces Aussie Pineapple and Blood Orange. Cheers. That is a really, really thin sauce. You know what? Cheers. Oh, yeah, you get the <clears throat> nice little kick. The dodgy pineapple peppers. You get the bell pepper and the pineapple. Maybe a hint of that blood orange. Definitely some fibers from the fruit in there. It's, it's got some heat though, man. That's a, it's a good two and a half. I just wish it wasn't so thin, but... Fair shake and give it one more try. That's pretty good. Now, Aussie pineapple peppers are delicious. Great flavor. Yeah, I put the heat about two and a half. Again, fill it right there. Flavor.
<clears throat> Five and a half out of ten. I hate to go that low, but I have to. For the fact that I just get pepper, a little bit of that pineapple, maybe a hint of the orange and the bell and and the pie, and the bell peppers. I'm not really getting any of the garlic or anything. Excuse me, pepper burp. It's just um it's more heat from the peppers than anything. <clears throat> I wish it had more a little bit of that more of that orangeish flavor. I know it's a blood orange, it does taste a little different than a regular orange, but not really it. It's just more like the the algae peppers, the bell peppers, and the pineapple with a hint of that orange, but yeah, I mean it's got great heat. Um I probably would put this on a salad. <clears throat> or, like I say, maybe marinate some chicken for fajitas or something in it, but five and a half on flavor. I wouldn't buy it again personally, but that's just my opinion. So Ross's sauce is Aji pepper, pep, Aji pepper, Aji pineapple, and blood orange. <laughs> so with that, although do check your site out at sauces, saucebyross.com. They have all kinds of good sauces on there, though. Excuse me, pepper, pepper again. But with that said, I hope you enjoyed this review. See you next time.